What's up my friend, welcome to part seven in this Kajabi Secrets mini series. In this video, I wanna share with you two really quick uh, little tips. Uh, number one is how to create a wait list. And number two is how to set up a giveaway for your uh, business, whether that's you know doing a YouTube video and you wanna give away a certain product, you can do that inside of Kajabi really easily and setting up a wait list as well. So first of all, let's quickly adjust the wait list. Let's say you have a product that's open and closed and the, uh, the cart is closed, so, so uh, people cannot buy that product at the moment, but you still want to get their contact information so that you can open it up to them maybe once in a while privately for those people who are interested in joining your waitlist. So the way you do this is really, really simple. It's just a form, right? So all you would need to do is set up a landing page that says, um, this course is currently closed. Uh, feel free to sign up below to join the waitlist. And then you have a form there, just like any opt-in page. So here's my form. Um, this VCS is my Virtual Composer Summit uh, live coaching group program. And here you can see a single opt-in, just like my regular forms, uh, first name and email address. And then the most important thing you wanna do is two things. Number one is to send them an email to say you're on the wait list. And I also give them a couple of bonus guys as an incentive for joining the wait list here. But yeah, as soon as they uh, submit the form, I send them an email and then the subject line is you're on the wait list, right? So that's great. But the other thing I wanna do is add a tag and I can create that tag for myself. So when the form is submitted at a tag, I just created this tag VCS waitlist, and that's also added to them. This is important because I have to be able to reach out to them and only them for the people who submitted this waitlist form when I open up the doors to these people privately. So I don't wanna send it to my whole list, I only wanna send it to the people who expressed interest in this event or in this product. So that's why I add that tag and then I can select that tag when I create this email broadcast. So only send to people with the tag VCS waitlist, right? So pretty self-explanatory there. A giveaway is actually pretty similar. So uh, again, it's another form. I just call it giveaway. And again, single opt-in, uh, first name, email. Now this one, I also ask for their YouTube channel name because I also um, ask people to leave a comment under the video of the giveaway. So I can double check just to see if they left a comment there and refer back to their YouTube channel name to really see if they left a comment. Um, but aside from that, the automations are pretty similar. So I also send them an email to say you're entered, right? And then here's my library buyer's guide as an additional gift. But again, I'm adding a tag that I change every single time I do a giveaway because I'm giving away a different product every time. So the, this product, uh, it had the name swells in it. It was like string swells or something. So I just call this swells. And this is the tag I add when they submit the giveaway form. And then when I'm ready to show them the results, I'll send out an email, but only to the people who have this tag swells or strings or woodwinds, whatever it is that I created the tag for to remember that product, right? And that's as simple as it gets. So the main two things to keep in mind is number one, to send them an email to just reassure them that they're entered or that they're now on the wait list. And number two is to add a tag to make sure that you can reach out to them and only them when the event is finished and you're ready to reach out to them to either reopen the product for a wait list or um, announce the results of a giveaway. Okay, hopefully that kind of makes sense. It's pretty simple as you can see, but I did want to cover it just in case um, there were any doubts or any questions. Um, I've been using this method for quite a few years. It's worked really well for me and I and really, I'm delighted that I can do all of this on the one platform, Kajabi. Um, when they say they're an all-in-one, I, I, I actually believe that because it's been the case for me. So I could highly recommend trying out Kajabi for yourself. If you want to try out your online business and build it um, on a single platform that has everything you need, then Kajabi is a great choice. And they usually give you 14 days on their website. But if you use my affiliate link down below, ChristopherSue.com slash Kajabi, I can get you an extended 30-day free trial. So more than double to set everything up. And as a thank you, I'll also give you two bonus mini courses is Kajabi in 30 days and content marketing for creatives. And those will help you along the way, building your business and scaling your income while earning back your time. So thank you so much for watching. I'll catch you in part eight and I'll see you in that video. Take care.